If you're getting a loan, the lender will require an appraisal. This is where a third party examines comparable sales to assure the lender they're making a sound investment and not overpaying for the property. The lender is responsible for ordering the appraisal, but the buyer pays for it and it just gets added to your final closing costs. If the appraised value comes back at the contract price or higher, that's great news and there's nothing to be done except move forward. If the appraised value comes back below the contract price, we'll submit an appraisal objection asking the seller to reduce the price to the appraised value. This is because a lender won't issue a loan for more than the appraised value. The appraisal objection is another negotiation. The seller could agree to reduce the price or ask you, the buyer, to come up with cash to make, the, make up the difference between the appraised value and the contract price. Or you could meet somewhere in the middle. If you come to an agreement, we move forward. If not, the contract would automatically terminate and you would get your earnest money back. But don't worry, that's extremely rare and 99 times out of 100, we come to an agreement. This is usually one of the last steps in the loan approval process. So after this, we are getting close to closing.